you know, I, I talked to a chick. She said, oh, I ain't going to compete for no man. I, well, whether you know or not, you compete. And you're a woman between the age of 20 to 30. You need to prioritize marriage before career. Prioritize marriage before career. Here's why, right? As a woman, you're highly valuable, especially from the ages of 20 to 30. Highly sought after from men of all ages. So you need to prioritize getting married. Well, how do you do that? First off, you shouldn't be talking to no dudes that's your age. Plain and simple. Most guys are marriage material until they're 35. Fellas, did you hear that? Most men are not marriage material until they're 35. If you want to be married, it's going to take you a while to find you a suitable candidate. And you have to be the best version of yourself. Ladies, you are the best version of yourself from the moment you hit 20. All the way up to, that is the best version of yourself that you're going to be. From the 30s and 40s, yeah, you, you still, you still marketable, but not as much, right? So as a woman, you should prioritize getting married before career. And then when you're married, then you can focus on the career. Because the right man is going to support you and uplift you and help you get to the goal that you want to in your career, right? So because here's what happens when you're a woman and you hit 30. You done dedicated your whole life to building your career. You're there, right? And now you feel that you want somebody that's on an equal level, right? Well, here's what happens. It's nothing wrong with that. If you if you make $200,000 a year and you want somebody, go ahead. Everybody want to hit the lottery. But... The thing is, when you put that career first in your 20s and you get it, now you're ready to get married in your 30s and it's really urging you, your biological clock is ticking, it's going to be even tougher for you to find a spouse. Here's why. Remember when I said most men are marriage material to their 35? Well, most men, when they tend to get a wife, they tend to date younger. They're going to be going after the 26, 27, 25. That age range. Right? So that means now, ladies, you're competing with those women. Those women right there are your competition. You know, I, I talked to a chick. She said, oh, I ain't going to compete for no man. I, well, whether you know or not, you compete. You compete. T.K. Curtin said they got a new model coming out of college every year. A new model coming out every year, like, like cars. You know what I'm saying? That's your competition. So if you're 30, you done had a few failed relationships by this point, maybe some kids, you set yourself for a real uphill battle, a real uphill battle, versus if you take the time in your 20s, when you, you're your best self, right? You, you're your top shelf self. To get the most top shelf quality candidate. You should be marketing yourself when you're the most top shelf quality candidate. And ladies, for that, that's between 22 and 30. 